food. Some kids like cars, expensive clothes, selfies, money. I found out I enjoy food. You are a Jew from your mother. He is a Muslim because of his father. I'm sorry, is atheism matrilineal or patrilineal? My name is Abraham Solomon O'Day. Some people call me Avraham, some people call me Ibrahim. I prefer Abe. Happy birthday, I can help you guys out. You don't need help. Go home. I wish I could cook something communal that, that brings people together like you do. I was wondering if you could teach me. I could use some help. Sure. I want to do the bar mitzvah. And, and I'll go to mosque and I'll, I can I can do both things. It'd be massive. Remember when we thought Why don't Muslims drink wine? Alcohol dulls the intellect. Haven't you noticed that in your father? But that's not the way it is. That's not the way we it's live. It's a, a ramen taco. It's a taco with ramen noodles. Terrible. You are mixing fusion with confusion. Calling falafel the national food is another way Israel appropriates our culture. It was a mistake bringing a child into your messy life. That's just the way it is. That's just the way it is. what I'm going through. Maybe your generation can find some kind of peace. I hope. You can't choose your family, kid. Hey guys, it's Lisa here with a really cool list of three of the best classic movies to watch as a family. First up, The Sound of Music. Now, who could forget the Tinging Von Trapp family? Next up, Charlotte's Web, based on E.B. White's book, a classic about a spring pig named Wilbur who befriends a spider named Charlotte. And to close it out, Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory, the one from 1964 with Gene Wilder, not the one with Johnny Depp. What's your favourite classic family movie? Let me know below. And remember to click down here to subscribe.